Man, you talk about getting saved by an angel. I was just talking to my friend uh, this morning, and she was saying, hey, man, you, you got a real talent that you either find in the middle of fucking night, you, you either run into fucking assholes or you run into angels. Well, I, I told her angels. I said, I call these people angels. I, 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 I was so fucked a few minutes ago and uh, I have found an angel. Uh, I cannot believe that I have found an angel uh, out, out here unbelievable uh, <laughs> I, I was not going after that fucking bullshit in downtown uh, Pittsburgh Pennsylvania that I dealt with last night spending over an hour to go a mile and a half uh, there, there was no fucking way that I was getting in this truck and, and going on a 27 uh, minute ride uh, and, 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 this, and this angel uh, who's driving about 70 miles an hour in a speed limit 15. I, I know he's furious. Uh, <laughs> he's thinking, God damn. It, it, you know, doing favors for people. So, so this guy, this, this poor guy uh, is getting ready to lose about uh, probably 45 minutes out of his uh out of his beautiful evening doing me a goddamn favor uh but uh i am uh just uh i i am i i i am just fucked uh i have i have no internet i have no fucking uh, cell phone I have no robot the goddamn Sun is going down and what I'm doing I, I'm looking for a giant phallic symbol I'm looking for a giant stone penis uh, uh, on the side of the road in the middle of nowhere as darkness falls over East Bumblefuck uh, K Kentucky uh, and, and that was uh, that was my challenge, and, and I told my friend, uh, e e e you know, uh, I'm fucking believable. As I say, I know this guy is furious. Uh, <laughs> these angels. Uh, saving my ass. Oh. God, what would we do without angels? Uh, the the definition of an angel uh, has so many uh, d d different definitions. My my buddy uh, Jimmo in Austin, you know, who has the Airbnb in Austin. Uh, I'm I'm one of his angels. Uh, okay, so when I get okay. Uh, <laughs> oh God, it's knowing how to separate the angels out of the devils in your life. Uh, the, I've, it, it's, it's not like the guy is a total stranger. I guess who he is, is, is my friend's son, uh, who actually runs the Airbnb and, uh, who is in no mood to do this, I will uh, certainly offer him a margarita for his, uh, his drive home. But it is a gorgeous drive uh, through uh, East Bumblefuck, Kentucky in the setting sun. Oh, Jesus. But this... He, he refused. I said, just write it down on a piece of paper. I've been to where we're going three times in my life. I, 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 I said, brother, uh, I, I said, I have been there. This is his parents' house. I said, I've been there three times. I never had a fucking smartphone. Never had one. 
just write the directions down. Just write down the fucking directions for me, brother. And he uh, absolutely uh, did not want to get me lost with his... He said, J just get in your fucking truck and follow me and I will take you there. Oh, God. All right. But now, of course, I'm going to have to find my way back home at 11 o'clock tonight in the pitch black dark uh, with a couple of stiff drinks in me. I, I'm, what, what I'm doing now, I'm, I'm going to have to reverse this uh, at 11 o'clock tonight. Um, I'm, I'm going to suggest to my friends that I just stay at their house. It would make it a hell of a lot easier. Uh, <laughs> I mean, I, I've stay, they have a tiny house. I, I think what we will end up doing is I will just stay with, uh, with Dan and Judy, and I will be interviewing Dan about bullshit. We're going to talk about bullshit. Uh, all right. So now we, he has a car in front of him, so now we can't drive at 70 miles an hour. Oh, uh, Lord. Anywho, all right. The never ending adventure continues live from Possum Belly, Kentucky. Bye, guys.